at Coventry. Fantastic result. Nathan Teller, the man of the match. Fantastic goal. Right, this is Let's Talk Burnley Football Club number 54. And I've got the team news. Uh, Peacock Farrell, who was re replaced uh, Murek because he was injured. Uh, Vitinho, Harwood Bellis, Bayer, Bayer, Matheson, Cork, Cullen, Brownhill, Teller, Zaori and Rodriguez. And so substitutes were French, Franchi, Taylor, Goodmanson, Barnes, Benson, Bastian and Roberts. Now, as the last um, video I did was a text, I read it as it actually happened. I'm going to go back to that and we'll start in the sixth minute. Um, Jay Rodriguez header from the centre of the box misses to the right, assisted by Anes Zaori, which was a cross. Uh, the seventh minute attempted miss Josh Cullen right foot shot from the centre of the box. In the tenth minute, uh, Taylor Harwood Bellis right foot shot from uh, the centre of the box as as uh, is high went over the bar, uh, assisted by Josh Brownhill. Save from Taylor Harwood Bellis header, assisted by Ian Matheson in the 21st minute. Uh, Nathan Teller left foot shot blocked. And the 22nd minute, Jordan Bayer yellow card for a bad tackle. Um, in the 29th minute, Josh Brownhill right foot shot. And then um, later on, yellow card for Jack Cork. Uh, 32nd minute, Jay Rodriguez, right foot shot, assisted by Nathan Teller. And then we have the goal, the 39th minute goal. Nathan Teller, right foot shot from the right side of the box to the bottom left corner and it hit the post and went in, assisted by Josh Cullen. Fantastic. Um, that was a through ball from Josh Cullen. Um, 44th minute, yellow card for Ian Matheson. And then we have half time, so it's uh, Coventry Neil Burnley one. Okay. Um, uh, after half time, a shot from Anis Zaori, right foot shot from outside the box, is blocked, assisted by Ian Matheson. In the 53rd minute, Jay Rodriguez shot from the from a difficult angle is close, assisted by Josh Cullen through ball. In the 56th minute, Ian Matheson right foot shot from outside the box is blocked, assisted by Josh Brownhill with a cross. Uh, 67th minute, Anis Zaori right foot shot, assisted by Josh Brownhill. In the 74th minute, we have a substitute, Johan Goodmanson replaces Anis Zaori. Um, and shortly after that, Joanne Goodmanson had a, a, a great opportunity to make it two uh, when there was a mistake in the Coventry uh, defence and uh, he, he actually hit it on the floor and therefore the goalkeeper saved it. If he'd always chipped it over his head it would have been two nil. Right, um, so Joanne Goodmanson came on and replaced Anis Zaori. Uh, Connor Roberts replaces Nathan Teller in the 80 third minute and the 89th minute we have another substitute Ashley Barnes replaces Jay Rodriguez and then we have full time so it's Coventry nil Burnley one fantastic three points right the stats for this game um, Burnley had 60% of the possession 13 shots four shots on target uh, seven corners and eight fouls now, Burnley have played 13 games, won 5, drawn 7 and lost only 1. Points, 22. Right, um, Burnley's home game, next home game is Swansea. Uh, this Saturday, the 15th of October. And then we play away at Birmingham on Wednesday the 19th of October at 7.45. Uh, then we play Sunderland away, uh, Saturday the 22nd of October. And then after that we've got Norwich at home, which was the replay uh, 
earlier in September, the 25th of October, uh, Tuesday at 8 o'clock. And then on the 29th of October, we play Burnley Play Home to Reading. Okay, we just turn the, turn the page. Okay, right, just to let you know what actually happened today. Uh, Sheffield United lost um, to Stoke 3 1 away, um, 24 points. Norwich lost 2 3 against Preston, 24 points. But Queen's Park Rangers won 2 1 against Reading, 24 points. And Burnley now have 22 points. So we're in a very good position, as I said, I've always said this, we're only two points now away from the top of the league. And I've always said this, haven't I? The last two or three videos I've been saying, Burnley are going to be definitely Christmas, by Christmas, top of the league, if not before. Now we have the World Cup coming up, uh, so Burnley will not be playing any more matches uh, after the, I'm not too sure now, um, 13th of November, something like that. And then they come back on the 10th of December and they play at Queen's Park Rangers. So I believe, still believe that Burnley will be number one by Christmas. Okay, well that's it for now. Um, I've, gi I've given you the, um, well you see it now, you've seen the uh, highlights of the game. Okay, let me think. Let me tell. Tell me what you think on the comments on below, and uh, I'll get back to you as I always do, and we'll we'll have a little chat and see what you think. Um, again, I'm very positive. I've always been positive on this channel. I never criticise Burnley. It's it's early days, but I'm sure we're going to be there in the end. Up there, Clarice. Come on, Burnley. All the best.